everyone, this is Chaitali and I'm back for another part of the mini-series that I'm running for Craft D Bozy, the tool that I introduced you to yesterday for making cute and easy bows. This time, the second part of the series, I'm calling it bow a -thon. So when I got uh, talking with Donna, uh, who's the creator of the tool, she challenged me to try and create as many bows as I can in one minute because she was like, the tool is really, really easy to use. So I took her up on the challenge, and today I am going to try and create as many bows as I can in one minute, right in front of you. So what I have is, I have my tool, I have it set, preset to these two parts, because um, I found that this size works the best for me, um, and this is the size that I think looks good on my 4.25 by 5.5 cards. Uh, so I'm going to stick with it. Uh, the actual bow is this size and each loop is half of this size. And then you can trim off the tails to whatever length you want, of course. Uh, so I'm going to stick with this size for my uh, bows today. And then because I'm a beginner, uh, I gave myself uh, another liberty. Uh, which is, I have this ribbon um, which I have cut to size already. So uh, I have a whole bunch of cut stack of this ribbon here, uh, and I'm hoping I can use the entire bunch, but uh, we'll see how that goes. So I have um, a whole bunch of these, and my tool is ready to go, and I think we're ready to get started. <laughs> Okay, so that was a whole lot of fun. Uh, and this is coming from someone who has hardly ever made bows on her cards. That's me. And uh, I try to fake my way through all the time with stamped bows or paper bows or uh, just folding ribbon loops over. Uh, so even getting to these many bows in a minute was amazing. It's really fast to use and uh, you can mass produce bows on cards all the time. So really coming from not having any bows on even my more complex cards uh, to thinking about mass producing cards with bows is a big step for me. Uh, so these are actually going to go on some Christmas cards for me. That's why the silver ribbon. And uh, you will see one of those cards today in my post. Uh, and then I'm also going to mass produce a lot more of them with all of these bows. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow with the third and final part of this mini series. And I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you. I also convinced you that this is a fantastic tool to use. Thank you. See ya.